So I'm curious, so you win the Golden Globe for Goliath, and, and you said, I think, in, in the press room backstage that you had wanted to play a guy who's had to sort of fight his way back from nowhere because it was something that you related to. Mm. Um, what did you mean by that, and in what ways do you relate to this Billy character? I, I like the idea of a guy who who knows what it's like to be somebody, and uh -huh. right now they're not. The hardest thing, honestly, for me in that, as well as movies like, like in Armageddon, the hardest thing for me is always if I have a bunch of technical stuff to say, mm -hmm. like lawyer stuff. Jargon. If, yeah, jargon. Yeah, if, yeah, if, yeah. if you have to <clears throat> say stuff like that, I want to be able to say it knowing what it means. Mm -hmm. Well, like I was saying, we'll take that up at my hearing because I'm sure your honor knows, as any good judge would, even the corrupt kind, that by holding me in contempt, you entitle me to a hearing. A hearing in which I'm allowed to introduce evidence including, but not limited to, misdeeds by defense counsel, and here's the good one, judicial bias. That's right, Your Honor, I said judicial bias. Just put it on my tab. And so, what do you do? You go talk to NASA guys and hang out with some astronauts and say, hey, when I say this, what the hell does that mean? Mm -hmm. And they tell you, you go, okay, now I can say that with confidence. Sure, mm -hmm. sure. And uh, I played an air traffic controller one time. Uh, uh, in, uh, pushing 90s, 10. Pushing 10, right. <laughs> and I went to air traffic control school. Yeah. Uh, Cusack and I both went to air traffic control school I up in that. Toronto. <laughs> and and uh, uh, actually did it. I mean, I can land a plane in Newark. That's, yeah. <laughs> you know I mean? But so. you gotta learn that stuff or you can't just say it. Yeah. Right. And, and so I found that the hardest thing on the Goliath was learning what all this legal stuff meant, and once I knew what it meant, then you, can. then you feel like a lawyer. And my wife says I'm like a lawyer anyway, <laughs> and arguments, you know, and I kinda am. One of the problems I had early on, in the early 80s, uh, was I would go up for uh, parts of Southern guys, because I was from the South, and they always told me I wasn't Southern enough. <laughs> <laughs> and I would go up for parts of bad guys, and they told me I wasn't mean enough, because if you didn't go into the casting director, this is before you ever got to see the directors and all that, yeah. you know, uh, if you were going in for a bad guy, and let's say it's a Southern or Midwestern bad guy, if you didn't jump on the table and spit and scream, hmm. Hmm. You didn't get the part. Right. And if I didn't play a Southerner like this here and talk like <laughs> this and come up, boy, I tell you what, I never did, see, you know, if I didn't do that, <laughs> I didn't get the part. So oh, if I came in for the Southern bad guy and I said, listen, man, one more word out of you and I'll fucking kill you. Do you understand me? And then, I, yeah. And they're like, next, no. <laughs> you know. <laughs> I mean, I was destitute out here for years, you know, and uh, I, I now look back on those days as probably my best times out here really? because awesome. everything that I do now and draw on comes from that, you know, and... Uh, of not wanting to go back to that place? No, I, I loved it in the moment. Right. Uh, I forgot... Uh, how, uh, I, I, after a while, you forget what it feels like to dream. Mm -hmm. hmm. And so I remember being so alive and so eager and, and so uh, in a fever. Mm -hmm. I mean, a bad fever, too, you know, yeah. uh, all at the same time. Uh, but when you have everything ahead of you, uh, and, and you're dreaming like that, it, it feels so great. And maybe, maybe at the time, uh, you know, you, you wish things were different or you weren't starving to death or whatever it is. But uh, when I look back on those days now, they were some of the best times of my life. What and, were you dreaming uh, of? Dreaming of being able to be, I never thought I'd become a movie star. Hmm. I dreamed of being an actor mm -hmm. and maybe being fifth or sixth guy down the line, mm -hmm. playing a part like Walter Houston might have mm. back in the old days or mm -hmm. whoever it was. That's, that's what I thought. I liked Warren Oates mm. yeah. and guys like that. Mm -hmm.
Hey, it's Billy Bob Thornton. I'm uh, Jeffrey Wright. Hi, I'm John Lithgow. Hi, I'm Riz Ahmed. Hi, I'm Ewan McGregor, and thanks for watching The Hollywood Reporter on YouTube. And thanks for watching The Roundtable on Hollywood Reporter, YouTube style thing. Cool.